I just got a couple boxes of IMI's 77 grain uh, Mark 262 equivalent uh, loading. And uh, just I've been wanting to try this stuff out for a while, see how it compares to some Black Hills 77 grain ammo that I've got. Um, the IMI seems to be a little bit uh, easier to come by, and it's probably about 40% less than uh, Black Hills. So I looked on Midway's website this morning. Um, both were available. You could get the, the cheapest you could get for the IMI, I think was like 94 or 97 cents around and versus a dollar 40 for, for Black Hills. So if it performs well, I'd be happy to save 40 cents around. Uh, so we'll go out to the range and see how it does. All right, I'm going to start with five rounds of Black Hills 77 grain Mark 262. All right, now five shots of the IMI 77 grain razor core. All right, we'll go check numbers here in a minute, but the top left, top right are Black Hills, string one and string two. And on the bottom left and bottom right is the IMI string one and two. Um, we'll take a look at the numbers, check out the group size. It is getting a little bit windier out here than I would like, uh, but we'll see what the numbers show. Okay, here's where we ended up. So for string one of the Black Hills, uh, average velocity was 2673 with an extreme spread of 50 and a standard deviation of 18. The uh, first string of the IMI was uh, 2644, extreme spread 31, standard deviation of 10, certainly reflects in that uh, lower left group. Um, second string on the Black Hills, pretty, pretty close, 2661, 31 and 10, and the IMI 2633, 47 and 15. Um, so the Black Hills is a little bit faster, roughly 20 feet per second, I think advertised from what I've uh, read on or seen from the manufacturers shows the difference of 10 feet per second uh, with the IMI being that much slower. Uh, but overall, uh, super happy with how the IMI performed, especially given that its availability is a little bit better um, and the price uh, is definitely cheaper than the Black Hills. Uh, you can see the groups there as far as measurements, measured center to center, uh, and, and that best group bottom left there, uh, just under three quarters of an inch. So pretty solid. It was getting a little bit windy, um, but I would have no problems buying a bunch more of the IMI 77 grain. So that's what I'm planning to do. Hope this helps you out.